Hi, I'm Dov S.S. Simmons, and this is WebFilmSchool.com, home of the free film school on the web. I hope you heard that. Free film school on the web. And also, we're the creators of the acclaimed two-day film school and the amazing DVD film school. Let's head back to the free film school. This filmmaking tip, filmmaking tip number 61, is about how to write a bank check while making your feature film. And we're on right now bank check number eight on how to make an independent feature film that a studio will call a one to two million dollar feature, but you make for 250 to 400 thou. I want you to take a look on the screen right now. Look at the top sheet of a budget coming up there. We're going below the line now to line items five through 12, your vendor and equipment suppliers, and we're gonna go to line item eight, check number eight, expendables. Writing a check for about $5,000. Expendables. Sometimes they're called consumables. What are these? These are one-time only use them items. What that means is use them once, then you've expended them, you can't use them again, you've consumed them. Filters, gels, gripping tape, gaffing tape, batteries. You use it, you can't use it again. You know, your gaffer wants some expendables, your grip wants some expendables, your production designer, the electrician, the cinematographer. Now, here's how Studio Features do it. They go to an expendable store. Take a look on the screen to the side. You'll see websites for addresses of where to buy expendables. So you can pay retail and purchase everything you need. It'll probably cost about $10,000 for your shoot. Don't do that. Here's what you're going to do. Every time you hire a cinematographer, a production designer, a gripper, a gaffer, they have their own kit. In their own kit, they've accumulated leftover expendables from other shoots that haven't been expended or used yet. So when you make your deals with your cinematographer, production designer, your sound man, your grip, your gaffer, ask them if they have a kit. When they say yes, you'll be using their equipment. Maybe add on a little bit onto their salary. So instead of spending $10,000 at expendables, you're only going to spend $5,000. So put the check in expendables five thousand dollars on an independent feature film you just save five thousand dollars happy filmmaking now here's what you've just learned expendables during your shoot you will need expendables sometimes called consumables they're items that you use one time you don't use again filters gels etc now, the way you could buy it is you can pay retail and just go to an expendable store and you'll probably spend upwards of $10,000. Or the inexpensive way is when you hire your individual crew people, they come with expendables and what they nickname their kit. The director of photography has it, the grip, the gaffer. Add on a little bit onto their salary to use their kit, and at the most, this will cost you five thousand. You just save five thousand dollars buying expendables or consumables. You know what? In about two minutes, you got some really good information on writing a check to make your feature film. My real class is the one thousand minute two day film school class. Go to my website, webfilmschool.com, and you'll see where the next two-day film school class is. And by the way, if you don't want to wait or don't want to attend, which is about 90% of the viewers, you will order the DVD film school. Here it is, over 1,000 minutes, 16 one-hour DVD filmmaking lessons with workbooks on how to produce, how to write, how to direct, how to act, budgeting, scheduling, sc cinematography, lighting, editing, marketing, distributing. It's all here. If any of you want to be writers, producers, directors, filmmakers, even actors, and break in the industry, the DVD Film School will give you the information. God bless. Happy filmmaking.